What's up guys and welcome back to another video. So guys, I'm back with another video and today I'm going to teach you a very interesting topic. That is, today we will study two topics that are first we will understand about the thing that is finding percentage of the given number or quantity. This is our first topic. Second topic is increase and increase and decrease in percentage. Okay, so let's start with the first topic that is finding percentage of a given number or quantity. Like we can take an example that is first is 20% of 150. Now how we will do this? Now how we will find 20% of 150? Now what I have told you in previous video? I have told you that of means multiplication. It means 20 into 115 will be there. So how we will write? First, we will write 20% in the numerator and now what we will write in the denominator. Now, in the previous order, I have also told you that the word percentage simply means out of 100. So, 20 will be out of 100. So, it will be 20% out of 100. And how will my, and from which number we will multiply? We multiply by 115. Because here it is of. It means 20 into 115 upon 100. So now you are clear that how to solve this. Now we will solve this. So 0 and 0 will, will, cancel, will get cancelled. 2 1s are 2 and 2 5s are 10. 5 1s are 5 and 5 23s are 115. So the answer coming is 23. Okay. So the answer simply came as 23. So now I clear that how to take out how to take out the how to find percentage of a given number of quantity. It means how to find 20% of 150. We simply did nothing. We did we took out 20 upon 100. It means 20% out of 100. We always do if there is a percent sign at that this number, then we will write it in numerator. It means 20 upon 100 into into from which number 20 is multiplying. So it is 115. So into 150. Then the answer came as 23. So it means 20% of 115 is 23. Now we will take one more example. Now, now what is one more example? One more example is 9% of it. Of rupees one twenty. Okay, so nine percent of rupees one twenty. How we will do this? We will follow the same step. We will uh, here it is nine percent. So nine upon hundred. Okay, so nine percent out of hundred. So nine upon hundred, and then what we will do? Then multiply by one twenty. Okay, because here it is of. It means multiplication. Nine percent into one twenty. So nine into 120 upon 100. Now, 0 and 0 will get cancelled. And then we will write 9 into 12. So, 9 into 12 is 108 upon 10. So, 108 upon 10. Now, what the answer comes? Here is 1 0. So, it will come here. So, it will become 10.8. Okay. So, so the answer become, becomes in 10.80. We can say 10.8 also and we can say it at 10.80 also. Okay. So now we are clear that how to find the percentage of a given number or quantity. Now we will learn about the second topic that is increase in percent and then we will learn about decrease in percentage. Okay. So first here we will write increase. Now, now what is our first question? First question is that increase rupees 60 by 6 percent. Okay, increase rupees 60 by 6 percent. How will it increase it? So, we will simply first we will take out the amount of increase. Means how much amount is coming on increase. Means how much amount will get increase. So, how we will do? We will simply, we are here it is 6%. So, what we will do? We will do 6% out of 100. So, it will be, it will become 6 
upon 100 and then it will multiply by 60. Okay. So it will get multiplied by 60. Now, now it will get cancelled. So 0 and 0 will get cancelled and then 6 into 6. What is 6 into 6? It is 36 upon 10 which becomes 3.6. Now this is the increased amount. Means it is the amount of increase which we will get increase. Okay. We can write it as 3.60 also. It is written 3.60. Now, now, now we will take out the increased amount. So how we will take out the increased amount? It will be 60 rupees plus 3.60. Okay. So 60 plus 3. Wait. 60 plus 3.60. Which becomes 63.60 okay so it becomes 63.60 rupees so now you clear that how to increase in percentage now we have taken one more example that is increase rupees 160 by 7 percent okay so now this is the question and we have to do increase in it so how will do we will follow the same step so if there is 7 percent so 7 percent out of 100 so 7 out of 100 into it will be multiplied by 160. Okay. So, it, 0, 0 will get cancelled. It will become 5 because 2, 5 is a 10 and 2, 8 is a 16. So, it becomes 7 into 8 which becomes 56 upon 5. So, 56 upon 5. Now, now what does the answer come? 56 upon 5 is 11. Wait. It is 11.2. We can write 11.2 or 11.20. Okay. Now, now it is the amount of increase. What will be the increased amount? It will be 1 rupees 160 plus 11.20. So 160. Wait. 160 plus 11.20. Which becomes 171.20 rupees. Okay, so now you are clear that how to do increase in percentage. Now we will move towards the decrease in percentage. Okay. Now, now we will do decrease in percentage. So here we will write decrease. Now, now we will take the question as um, decrease rupees 120 by 10%. Now, now how we will do it? We will follow the same step that we followed in increasing the percentage. So, what we did? We see here that there is 10%. So, 10% out of 100. So it becomes 10 upon 100 into it will be multiplied by this number which is 120. So here the 0 and 0 will get cancelled. So the answer comes as 12. So now this is the amount of decrease. Okay. So here this is the amount of decrease. Now what will you do? Now I will write 120 minus 12. So we will write 120 minus 12 which becomes rupees 108. Okay. It is the same as increasing in percentage. Only, only the difference is that here we put the subtraction sign. In increasing the percentage, here we put the addition sign. And in decreasing the percentage, here we put the subtraction sign. And there is no other difference. Okay. So, let's take one more example. So one more example is that decrease decrease rupees 50 wait decrease rupees 50 by 8 percent we will follow the same step that is 8 percent so 8 out of 100 so 8 upon 100 into 50 okay so 0 when 0 will can cancel it will become 2 uh, because uh, 5, 1 is 5, 1 is 5 and 5, 2 is 10. 2, 1 is 2 and 2, 4 is 8. 
so it becomes um, so it becomes four. Okay, so the decree amount of decreased is four. So the decreased amount will be rupees fifty. It means fifty minus four, which becomes forty six. So rupees forty six. So now you are clear that how to do finding the percentage of a given number or quantity. How to do increase in percentage and how to do decrease in percentage. So goodbye guys. In this video, this much only. We will meet in next video. So if you have any doubt related to my video, then you can comment me here on YouTube or you can join my Discord server. Whose link is given in the description box. So goodbye guys.